Maria Grant. I'm on this collaboration channel. My friend Emily is helping me record this. Hi. This down. Love the music, but it's really loud. Um, yeah. So, one of our favorite things, me and Emily's favorite things, is music, which is going to be what we're going to be talking about. Um, so, the feud between Flyleaf and Paramore, which one is better or worse, is really a contradiction. I mean, like, I love both of them, Paramore and Flyleaf. So, I personally think, why not both? So, Emily, what will we be talking about? Well, why don't we start with, how long have you been a fan of Paramore? Um, I've been a fan of Paramore ever since seventh grade. So that was about six years ago. Um, they just really inspired me. They were really fun, and they kind of introduced me to rock, other than Avril Lavigne, but that's beside the point. Okay. Uh, how about Flyleaf? Um, Flyleaf, I'm sadly to say I've only been a fan of theirs since eighth grade, um, but still equally as good. I went from Paramore to Flyleaf because... Flyleaf showed a more tougher exterior, and it was something I really needed at the time, and what I still need sometimes. Uh, let's see. Does band merchandise signify who you love more? No, not at all. I mean, like, I have a ton of Paramore things. I'm a Paramore wrist fan. I have a Paramore sweater in the back of my chair. But yet again, I love both of them. I mean, like, I dress like Lacey sometimes. I have my jeans under my dresses, and... I don't think it signifies who you love more. I mean, it's just like a coincidence to me. Okay. What do you love about Paramore? Oh. What I love about Paramore is that they are just fun. They can also be really, like, sorrowful. And their sound and music and the way they portray it and the way they just, like, connect with my life and so many other people's lives. Just, it just really touches me, and they take time with the music. I love that. On the other hand, what do you love about Flyleaf? Oh, God. So, what I love about Flyleaf is that they're really mature. They talk about concepts, and their songs have a deeper meaning than what you think they are. So, that really was on like, my more like inter- kind of lit- literal side. And they're just so, like... They're so, like, epic, in my opinion. What makes you love both bands? The reason why I love both bands is because they both helped me in my life. Meaning that they were both there for me at points in my life where, you know, I had nothing else but music. So, they've both been by my side. And both their songs and stuff and their kind of taste in rock has helped me in both sides of my life. What were your first songs for both artists? Oh, my first song for Flyleaf was I'm So Sick. And my first song for Paramore was Misery Business. That was really new. I loved both videos. They were completely different, but I still love both of them. All right. And now, how do you feel about both bands splitting? Oh, God. When I heard that Flyleaf, well, Lacey, I heard that she left the band, I was really devastated. Mainly because I was going to go to a concert in New York City, and that I lived there. And when I heard that they replaced her with another girl, that she was a really nice singer and all. But I really looked up to Lacey for all these years, and I was dreaming of meeting her, VIP, and all that. And I was just really devastated. But when I heard her reasons for leaving, I kind of, you know, I wasn't trying to be selfish, so I accepted it. And as for Paramore, when I heard that Josh and um, Zach left, I was really surprised because I'm like, they seem like such a perfect fan, you know? They seem like all wholesome and family oriented, but I guess no one really knows what really goes on backstage, you know? And I respected their choices for leaving. They left in a really respectful manner, and Paramore went on to bigger things and bigger changes, and I guess it'll work out for everyone. So, I guess that's all the time we have. Um, thank Emily for being an amazing recorder. And thank the music for being awesome still. And I guess that's the end of my video. So, I hope you like it.